I'm Shelley Pearson and I'm a bird and wildlife photographer. I've been shooting birds for over 12 years now and I'm just as passionate, if not more now, than what I was when I first started. You just never really know on the day what you're going to get. It's just very interesting and the birds are, there's something about the birds that really inspires me. Okay, my first impressions when I got the Fuji out of the box was how light it was, which is which is really good for me in the field because I'm doing a lot of walking and the 150 to 600 is a light lens. So that combination with the X-H2S is really great for me. Um, it, yeah, and I, I can put it on a tripod if I wish, but the majority of the time I don't. Before the upgrade of the autofocus, it, it was really good in the field. Um, I felt that there could be some improvement with the tracking. So after the upgrade, the autofocus system, I did notice a, a, a substantial um, improvement while I was shooting in the field. The tracking um, from a distance was really good. It would hold on to the bird, so it would grab the bird and I'd track the bird and the focus stayed on it. If another bird flew in front of it, it still held focus on the bird that I was had originally focused on. So that was really good. And also when the bird was close, so just say if it was sitting on a rock or something, um, it would hold focus if any birds flew up and flew past that bird. So I was that was one of the noticeable things that I did notice. I think the thing that I found was, um, you know like when you're photographing a bird and they turn their back to you, um, because the focus will go for the eye, but it still holds the head. So it doesn't jump off the bird when there's no eye contact. So when the bird comes around, you've still got the bird in the frame. and still got the focus on it. And then, you know, I might not shoot and I'll wait for the bird to come back around and it's still, and then it clicks back onto the eye which is, as a bird photographer, you want that eye. With the upgrade of the focus system, I'm certainly shooting things that I wouldn't have maybe shot in the past, and that is um, shooting through foliage. I love doing that because I love to get that vignetting around a bird from the out of focus uh, foliage and that. And the focus will grab the bird. So when I'm shooting through anything, the focus is a lot more, um, there's definitely an improvement in that. So when you're going for the action, and I would be on 30 frames per second, possibly 40, depending on um, what I feel is going to happen. And I have the, to get the tracking, I have to have the zone for the whole screen, so that, because the bird's going to be moving all over the screen, so that's what works for me. I think for, say for someone who's just starting out in bird photography, and they pick this camera up, and they pick it up and they see a bird flying, they're going to be amazed on the focus system because the focus is just going to grab that bird and they're going to move their camera and the bird's going to, the, the focus point's going to be on that bird and it even goes to the eye and it's really good in that regard. Mm -hmm. 